I'm Tracy Campbell. I am a television producer with WTTW Channel 11. I am an elder at the Lighthouse Church of All Nations, and I am an aspiring missionary. He asked me, what do you think you'll be doing in five years? And just out of nowhere, well, it wasn't really out of nowhere, but I know where it came from. But I just said, I want to be a missionary in Africa. And I was praying and praying, Lord, where am I going? And I discovered through a DNA test that I had DNA heritage in Africa, the, the um, Tikar Fulani Hausa people of Cameroon. I told my sister, and she introduced me to a, an organization called the Cameroon American AIDS Alliance, and I said, I want to go. I'd never been to Cameroon before. People kept saying to me, um, you're a producer, you should take a camera with you. You should record this whole event. I spent three weeks there. I think I had just as much fun as the people I worked with. I ended up doing some of the things I, I said I wanted to do, which was pray for people and, and just listen to people. And, and then I did some things I didn't want to do, which was carry that camera around, but I'm glad I did. We were at an invocation ceremony, and on a Sunday we were there for five hours, and these beautiful girls were singing. They sat patiently through this ceremony, and at the end of the ceremony, they serenaded us with songs. We attended two clinics about five-hour drive from Douala, which is the main port city. Dirt roads, big potholes. It was a huge hospital, or they call them rehabilitation centers. They had a clinic. They had something I'd never seen before. I, I thought I would never see in my life, which was a, um, a leper village. I've never been treated so well in my life by people who don't have nearly as much as I have. The food, I enjoyed so much. And after you hear so many things about, oh, don't eat this, don't eat that, at a certain point, you don't care anymore because the hospitality is so overwhelming. How can you say no? And even the children, I asked them, what do you do after you go home from school? Well, I read my books, and I sweep the floor, and I wash dishes, and I help my mom wash clothes. And they didn't say it begrudgingly. They said it with joy. The love is there. God's love is with you, and you can have it, and you have access to it. That's what I felt when I was in Cameroon.